Hi, this is Vladan from SX Virtualization Block. Let's create VMware MiH USB bootable stick. We will need Windows ADK with those components as on the screen on the system where we're gonna create this USB stick. Then we're gonna need to open elevated command prompt and also we need to extract the WinPE zip file depending on your system it's x86 or x64 there are two of them I extracted the 64 and we will need to edit the, the script to match our environment as you can see I have mirage server 01 lab.local we have the web server self-provisioning URL, URL and we have also the directory where the ISO going to be located afterwards and created. We have also put some VMware drivers, VMware tools drivers into this uh, driver directory. So right now we can copy this as a pass and paste it into our elevated command prompt and the process will start it takes about three to four minutes and I cut part of it because we were waiting for those steps to finish and it was too long as you can see the temporary directory got created automatically This uh, USB stick can be used for uh, uh, unbootable Windows uh, systems or laptops or it can be used for to provision laptops or desktops while on the field and uh, also to prevent uh, if you want to restore a system which is unbootable for example after a ransomware attack or virus attack so it's quite useful to have this USB stick if uh, you are running VMware Mirage in your environment it won't be long till the last step is finished okay let's have a look we will fire up our Rufus creation tool let's copy the path to the ISO and paste it to Rufus okay and we can name the USB stick some we can put some meaningful name Mirage and start the process okay it's just a warning that the USB key gonna be erased and all the partitions destroyed I'm using 8 gig USB stick that's the minimum so it copies the files and in a second it's going to be finished okay let's have a look the USB stick is here okay seems to be fine we will do a test to boot from this uh, ISO in a virtual machine from VMware workstation so we just need to hit the enter or any key to put the WinPE Win environment it takes only a few seconds and when it's up and running it just launches some scripts and the VMware Mirage client which will automatically connect to our 
mirage server and uh, after a while it get connected and it will get a message as a pending assignment I don't know if you could see it let's have a look pending assignment thanks very much for watching bye bye